welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a makeup look for valentine's day i don't celebrate valentine's day because i am single AF but that's okay because i'm pretty sure that a lot of people like me will celebrate valentine's day being single and other will celebrate it being a couple and Either way, you can wear this look if you want, you can put on makeup. Girl, you can or oh boy, you can do whatever you want. You don't need to be in a relationship to celebrate Valentine's Day, so do what you want. So today's video, so it's going to be this look, which is really romantic. It's flirty and romantic. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you want to join my little family of queens. You can click right over here, this little button right here, or down below if you're on your mobile. Also, don't forget to follow me on my Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr right over here. I'm here every day. Without further ado, let's get on with this video. On my primer, I'm going to use the Nivea Men Aftershave Balm. Okay, so now I'm going to use my foundation, the Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation in Y205, my NARS All Day Luminous Weightless foundation in Gobi because these two together make the perfect match for my skin. I'm going to use my concealer, the Fit Me concealer in 15, yeah, 15. So now I'm going to powder my face. I'm using my Stimat powder in transparent. Using my e.l.f. complexion brush. So now I'm going to go with my eyes and then I will finish the rest of my face at the end. I'm going to prime my eyes and I'm going to use my Essence Eye Hot Stage Eyeshadow Base. I'm going to use my Stila Natural Eyes Palette. Simple. Two color. You just need two color. I'm going to use this color right here, which is a matte mauve color. And then I will use this color right here, which is a metallic, shimmery, creamy beige with a pink undertone. The matte mauve is Bliss and the shimmery, metallic, rosy beige is Kitten. I'm going to use my Morphe M514 using Bliss. Apply it on my lid and in the crease. I feel like it's a little bit too light. So I want to use a darker color. So I'm going to use Sandstone. And it's like a deeper move. So I'm going to apply this again all over the lid with the same brush. I know it's going to look a little bit darker, but I really want to call it pop. So, so and now that I'm done with uh, most of the eyes, because we're almost done, I'm going to use the color that I talked about, this one, which is a kitten. I'm going to use an eyeshadow brush, a flat eyeshadow brush, using my MAC Fix Plus. I'm going Use the same brush and blend a little bit using the Bliss and Sandstone color together. Gently blend. Going back with the brush and the kitten.
I'm going to use this brush, the Eyes 200, and blend around here. Now I'm going to use my Real Techniques Essential Crease Brush and I'm going to apply the Sand Storm color under the lash line. I'm going to take this color right here, which is a matte cream, and with my finger, under my on my brow bone for contouring using my shade and light palette by Kat Von D I'm going to use this color to contour I wanted to try this brush which is by Morphe again and it's pointy brush I feel like this is for contour so I'm going to try So to bronze my face, I'm going to use the same Kat Von D palette and using this second color. And I'm bronze my face like you will bronze a face. Now I'm going to put some blush on and highlight. For blush, I'm going to use this blush, which is pretty scary. It's this sleek blush in Life the Pitch. And I'm going to use my Multitask Brush by Will Techniques. For highlight, I'm going to use my I Hot Makeup Palette, and it's the I Hot Chocolate. I'm going to use this little baby right here. I'm going to apply some mascara using the My Kiko mascara. And for false lashes, I'm going to these ones. These ones are the Lit Fly Eyelash in 303. So I'm going to use the Lagona Bridge because I like my pigmentation of my lip right now. I think it looks good, and this one is like the same color of my lips. Let's go with this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial and makeup look. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already to join my little family of queens. And also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And yeah, that's it. I will see you guys in my next video.